point to. How's the process <laughs> coming now with the knee? I'm, I'm sure it's a daily thing. Now. Yeah, it's going pretty smooth. Just trying to yeah. take it one day at a time and do as much as I can. Stay true. What do you feel when you're making those cuts in practice? I mean, how does it feel there? I feel fine, man. I don't, I don't think about it at all. Like, uh, the more I worry about it up here, it's going to really affect my place. I just I don't think about it. Now this is really what I'm Your thoughts on. about the true Everything freshman coach Knox was talking coming. about Ashton yeah. Shumpert and he said obviously he's got a long ways to go because he was a freshman and you were in his shoes one time. So he talks about his heart yeah, and that mentality that he, he, um, he works and people start to know. He's, he's going to be nice. He works hard. I mean, he, he, run, he runs real hard. He's like a, a bulldog. And as soon as he grasps like, the whole concept of the offense, he's going to be a real good one in this Mississippi State. What's it been like in practice for you guys with, with a lot of experience and a lot of talent and depth there? Obviously, each one of you all brings something different to the running game. How, how's that kind of played out so far? I mean, it's going pretty good for us. You know, we, uh, we've done this before time and time again, so it's just going pretty smooth. We're just trying to, like, uh, be more crisp on things, sharpen up everything. A lot of people talk about purpose, oh, yeah. but it seems like the rest of you guys are going to kind of really get a lot of playing time this year. Just talk about that. Oh, yeah, we 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 just trying to come in and work. We compete with each other and we like we we all boys. We hang out with each other a lot and we just we wanna come in here and uh, do the best that we can. Coach Mullen and Coach Knox talked about Oh man, it's very I've heard, even heard it in basketball. Yeah, yeah. Coaches say the same thing. When you go through that ACL tear the second time, it's a lot easier mentally because you know what to expect. Talk about your process. I think this one it was a lot easier than the first time because, uh, like you said, I knew what to do. I knew what to expect. I knew what I did wrong last time. I know what I did right, and I can just focus and build off of that. How has it been with Cam? I mean, you. Obviously, it's probably something you know getting used to with the knee because you're going pretty hard and going pretty regular. I mean, what, I don't like what's the toughest thing <laughs> setting you back, and what's been the easiest thing? <laughs> uh, I think I'm, I'm doing all right overall. I mean, like uh, it's, it's more of a mental thing at this point now. I think I'm doing. Good. And your attitude's always been upbeat. You've always been one of the most positive players on the team. Right, now is that it? May helps a lot to be resilient. I mean, if you put your mind to it, you can do anything. So if I tell myself I'm all right, then I'm gonna be all right. He come to me at some time. It's it's crazy how 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 much he's try to how much he try to learn and you know, but yeah, he messed me up. Nick's got a question. <laughs> I believe Mr. Griffin from the Associated Press has a question. Um, I'll be back. Stay right back. <laughs> what would you ask him if somebody stuck a camera in your hand? Um, how do you get your leg so big? <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> oh, you pushed a button there. <laughs> Oh. Derek, talk about that, that room, that meeting room with so much <laughs> talent and depth in that room. Just the bond that you guys have. Um, it's, it's really quiet. It's really quiet in the meeting room because Knox is all about business. So, you know, we go in there and we learn every day. It ain't much talking up in there, but it's, it's definitely. You know, we just trying to take our knowledge to the next level and teach Shump, you know, like put Shump on that level right now of understanding, you know what I'm saying, what to do, you know, go out there and execute of how to do it. So that's pretty much it because everybody in the room know it, know it, you know, it's just taking it to the next level. How does the offense from the offense perspective change? We saw it this spring, Tyler and Dak, or Dak wasn't there, but now Tyler and Dak being in the center a little bit more from y'all, whether it's steps or what, how does that change uh, it, it doesn't really. Basically, all our steps really the same on most run plays. Uh, nothing really changes. I guess uh, it's all the same. Coach mentioned during the scrimmage that the running game had some bright moments. Boys, well, you know, it seems like you guys are kind of setting the tone right now, especially with the young receivers. Yeah. Most definitely, um, we got to set the tone. Um, we got a lot of running backs, so we all going to get touches. So we definitely got to, you know what I'm saying, live up, live up to the expectations. So.